Today is a busy day at opposite ends of the cow fertility spectrum. On the one hand, this guy was born about... Girl. This girl was born about half an hour ago. And on the other, we've got the trailer that we're borrowing lined up down there because Sangria, our red cow, has not been able to get bred the last several times. And we've been trying since November. We've bred her three times and she hasn't taken. So we think something else is going on. She's been having heats and bleed offs, but she hasn't conceived. And the tech said that they were sure that she was at a really good spot. She's been having irregular heat cycles as well, uh, both timing and in her response to them. And so the AI tech suggested that we might need to be concerned about cysts. So we're taking her down to the vets, hopefully to get an ultrasound done to see if there are any cysts there. Hopefully we can get her treated because I like her a lot. Now I'm going to point out a couple things. She has had a calf before. This little guy right here. She, we know that the AI techs are good. We, there's a chance that the straws we've been using could be bad, but that's pretty slim. This, and she's even been in with a half bull, as it turns out, because we missed getting one of them on little onesie here. So Mac has been with her and he is quite active. So we know she's got a pretty good chance of being bred if she's actually been fertile. We're going to go ahead and get her ready. Calf seems like she's up and starting to nurse a little bit okay and getting around. They should be all right without us. She was rather difficult to get loaded. She didn't want to go up into the trailer, but finally treats and hay prevailed. So 13.3 millimeters, and she was in heat two weeks ago. So, yeah. so that's a bigger follicle. There are multiple follicles that I can feel mm -hmm. on her right ovary before even probing, and again, that's not expected at this point. In can you see the where? Cycle. Yeah. And we've got one, two, three on that side also. Okay. The nation for her would be to do. Are we at her nose? No, we're less. not at her nose. <laughs> to help rupture those follicles mm -hmm. and cause her to short cycle essentially mm -hmm. and then nose to actually get her into a normal cycle period. So now we're leaving the bed. Hopefully these two shots will take care of those cysts. Somebody is very happy to be back home. Come on sweetie, let's go. Good girl. You ready to meet the new member of the herd? Sandra, I have important news for you. Can you read the orange part? Pregnant. Willow. Sang when sangria, when cows are pregnant, that means they're gonna have a baby cow. A baby cow. In sangria is a baby cow. No. Okay. Yeah. Sangria just peed. Hi, I'm Simon. And I'm Heather, and we call this Cozy Cow Farm. We're not really farmers. Uh, but I'm a farmer. We just bought the farmhouse with the land. Uh, Got some chickens. Then we added some cows. And we're still trying to figure out what we're doing. So subscribe to join us on our journey of trying to learn this. Or comment and let us know what you'd like to see. Yeah.